employment is also not growing as much as it should be in construction, in manufacturing. The number of Canadians accessing employment insurance benefits is rising in Canada, with men leading the way. Canada is seeing nearly 33,000 more people reliant on EI from April to August of this year, with women either seeing steady or declining rates for the month of August, while men seeing increases across the board. The number of beneficiaries increasing in most occupations but uh, the, the sharpest increase has been in manufacturing and uh, uh, men tend to be m more employed in manufacturing than women are. I think that exact type of sentiment around traditional notions of masculinity and the men as breadwinner get mobilized in very populist ways. Adam Davies, a professor at the University of Guelph, says in an increasingly polarized world, stats like this could be used to spread a narrative that men are being further disadvantaged simply because of their gender. Certain segments of um, male populations feel this way, or uh, certain groups of men might have these feelings of disenfranchisement, there's certainly a risk for that to be politicized in a way that fuels right-wing um, political momentum, um, which can be very dangerous to uh, racialized communities, LGBTQ communities, um, can fuel xenophobia and anti-immigrant sentiments as well. Davy says as marginalized people see gains in the workplace, it's important to understand it isn't the result of men being targeted. Just because other groups are gaining um, in terms of representation and um, awareness, it doesn't have to put um, groups not um, who aren't part of that um, group who's making these gains at risk or at threat in any way. Not helping relieve that feeling of despair among some men. According to Stats Can, a sluggish job market is not only adding more people dependent on EI, but also causing a greater pool of them to fight for a smaller share of jobs. But HR professionals say that could be a time for self-reflection. There's lots of skills that they may have gained, so it's really lining those up what are they good at and trying to figure out how do those skills transfer into some other role in calgary edward jen city news